Okay, so I've actually been asked a lot about this thus far. Um, so I figured I'd make a video and maybe answer some questions about it. It's an 88 4003, nothing exemplary. Of course, it's got a little bit of thinnest checking. I don't know if you can see that. But the uh, hip shot bridge, Bartolini pickups. It's still not 100% complete. Uh, I do have, I, I did order a few parts for it that weren't really exact fits, like this plate here. I'll just get somebody to make another one of those. I've got the mono output hooked up to it now. I did wire it for stereo, so the opportunity is there. Uh, the neck looks. Decently, decently straight. Uh, I do need to kiss a little bit off the frets. I don't know if, once again, I don't know if you can see on the video, but there's a little bit on the edges that need to be, that need to be trimmed off. It, it just needs to go fret leveling, you know. It's been, things been played into the ground. Uh, there's a small chip. Lots of buckle rash on the back. Ding here, there, here. There's another one. Yep. Some wear right here, probably from a strap. And a, and a few pecs and whatnot here at the bottom end of the, of the base. I'm trying to get some good light here. There's a mark on the back of the neck. There's another one right where the light is right there. I don't know if you can see that. But what I did like about this one when I bought it was it the neck wasn't starting to pull right here like a lot of them of this age do. It's just uh it's in it's in good shape. Not really a whole lot of the fret wear. I don't know if it'll focus or not. Probably not. Whatever. Uh, custom black truss rod cover. I do need to. Uh, probably gonna have to route a little bit right here because this pickup. <laughs> is really really close to the strings so that's gonna have to be addressed which is no big deal you know might need to take an eighth not none not an eighth maybe a sixteenth out of the bottom of it and i should be able to clear so i'm not getting some magnetic pull on the g uh pots cts this is a, I think this is an Alpha, because I ordered uh, three CTSs and a Born push pull wire up a vintage tone, but it ended up being too deep, so I need an actual double stack tone pot. Have to order from Rick, I'm sure it'll be, be $30. And I'm still missing a little thing here, didn't have any of those at the store, whatever. Uh, this is a, like I said, it's an 88, so it does have the actual rosewood board and not the babinga. Started in 93, I think. There's the, the hip shot tuners, or drop-ins. They're about the same shaft length as the, uh, as the old Grovers. It, it looks like an old base. Because it is. So. Just more. Let's try to roll this into the light. You can, you can kind of see all the little pecs and dings on it. So it's it's a player. But I figured I'd I'd make this for um, everybody that is uh, curious about about this particular base. So there you go.